In sports, 1-0 sounds a lot better than 0-1. And for two coaches that haven't had a winning season in the last three years combined, Saturday's a pressure cooker. UTEP, New Mexico State throwing down this Saturday in Las Cruces. It's officially game week. And set the DVRs because we're bringing it to you live on the station that you are watching right now. There's just five FBS college football games in America on Saturday. This is one of them. 7.30 p.m. kick. I've got your pregame show at 7 p.m. And Eric told me I look really nice tonight, so I'll probably be wearing the same thing I am right now. New Mexico State off from practice today, but UTEP head coach Dana Dimmel addressing the media as he looks to beat the Aggies for the first time in his UTEP coaching career. Miners have lost the last three against NMSU. Gavin Hardison, though, the unquestioned starter at QB. For the minors, for the Aggies, we don't know who will be under center. Redshirt freshman Weston Egypt and junior college transfer Jonah Johnson have been battling in camp for that starting role. Coach Doug Martin has said he would like to name one before Saturday. So how does UTEP prepare for a team without knowing who's going to run their offense? We're going to have our game plan, you know, and it's not going to change on the two quarterbacks that we're facing by any means. We're going to attack them. Obviously, we feel good about our defensive line. So we don't necessarily have to bring extra numbers to get pressure on people, we hope, you know, with the talent that we have on our defensive line. And we have tremendous depth there right now. And so on a hot Saturday night um, here in the borderland, we're not going to, you know, be tiring our guys out. We're going to get a lot of guys in the game to play. Coach Dimmel rolling the dice with that D-line. The announcement on quarterbacks from Coach Martin could come as early as tomorrow.